the, the physicality, the intensity, these skates feels really high, maybe even compared to past years. Have you seen the same things on the ice? Yeah, for sure. Um, I think it's a group that you know wants to improve and wants to have a strong identity. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's been, been physical and aggressive, and uh, you know, we're always trying to make each other better. And the last year, I think, exit interviews, you were asked about, you know, the one three one, the one two two. You guys have made that change now. How has that implementation gone over the first couple of days? It's good. Um, it's exciting for sure. Like every anytime you do something new, I think it's like a good boost of energy. Um, gonna need more reps at it to kind of feel more comfortable. Right now, it just feels, you know, it feels new. Um, but that's good, and uh, you know, we're looking forward to it. What a lot of guys have talked about is it should get you know, wingers moving a little bit more and give you guys maybe a little bit more freedom and transition. Is that how you see it as well? Might be good for a player like you? Yeah, for sure. Um, when you when we do create turnovers, we'll have more speed, which is great instead of being flat-footed. Um, so, you know, we just got to create those turnovers. We're going to get chances. Another change. I mean, our view is with you guys for, for a few years. You now have Tanner Janot, a very different kind of player. How's that line been looking for you guys over the first couple of days? Yeah, I think it's been good. It's been a lot of learning about each other's tendencies and kind of what, what each other likes. Um, I, I really like his game. I think that he's a guy who forechecks super hard. Um, you know, you're talking completely different than Arby, right? So it's, it's a learning curve. But uh, I think that he won all the physical testing in the gym. Like, the guy is uh, he, he's an elite forechecker and a tough guy who's going to go to the net for us. And I think that's awesome. Completely different players, right? Like, does that change the identity of the line at all from what you guys were in the past? Um, I don't think so. I think that RV was a good four tracker in his own right. Um, I think that our identity was was hard work and then creating plays off of the hard work. I don't think we were a float around kind of line anyway. So um, yeah, I mean, I think a little different. He, he wants to go to the net a little bit more, um, which you know maybe allows us to do some of the things up high. Um, but we'll see. I, I think it's been a good fit so far. Yeah. Other than health, 31 goals. What was the difference last season goal wise for the production ones? I don't know. I I tried to commit to just uh, having fun out there and, and shooting the puck. Um, and then I shot it early and the puck was going in early, which, you know, obviously gives you confidence to keep shooting. So, um, but I'm just going to stick with that same mentality. If it, if it goes in early, great. If it doesn't, I'm just going to keep sticking with it and, uh, you know, just hopefully hopefully get some wins early. You talk about Genoa a little bit, but the other two guys that were brought in over the summer as well, does it also feel like those two guys still kind of fit that same kind of identity that the team's trying to develop? Yeah, absolutely. I think that uh, management did a really good job of bringing those guys in, um, making us a little bit more physical. The other team's going to have to keep their head up a little bit more, and I think that's awesome. Um, I, we want to have that identity. I think it's, it's a team that, you know, when you're playing against a team like that, it, it sucks, and we want to be that team. Um, so that's awesome.